What's up everybody, my name is Gian. Welcome to another episode of Aperture Fight Focus. Today I got something that I have to admit is a little bit over my head. Uh, this is about the interplay between Jeet Kune Do, Filipino martial arts, and Wing Chun. It's over my head, but I know there's something there. I've began to explore the interplay between these three systems just in the last year. And I gotta say, yo, it's quite rewarding, but a bit of context, this is not a fight. This is not a simulation of a fight. There's a lot of context missing because this is a clip from like a three-day camp. And if you're interested in, in seeing all of that context, there are actually, I think there were like 11 instructors in this camp. So this really represents the diversity of martial arts. And if you're all about that diversity and that exploration and finding your own cocktail, your own truth about how these interplay and how they relate to you, please make sure to check out www.aperture.university. We have an amazing library of content, but this one in particular is about connecting those dots. Now, without further ado, I'm gonna show you the video and then I'll see you at the end for a quick discussion about it, okay? Here it is. So I surge that, bang, I move out there and set that, oh yeah, his punch comes, there's a bounce down, there's a hit, I'll bounce and there's a control. So where do I want to go? I just want those sunglasses, just a second. All right, now we can keep going. Here we go, that's it. I tell you, these will be on eBay on Monday. All right, let's, let's back engage. Next thing you can tell. Yeah, that's right, that's only, I only do one or two shows a day, boys. No, it's okay. Oh, that's fine. Anyway, back to the interior roll. Depending on the energy, so if I push his energy down, where's he going to go? He might hit me in the shin, so I want to empty that out. He's going to bring that into a two. And we're going to carry the two. Then I'll roll that back into a one. Take it back into two. See, at any time on the two, I, this is literally a hit. So as two comes through, I'm popping that. Hold your stick like that. So I'm, I'm popping that. That's his wrist. Mm -hmm. So I'm moving one, pass it to two, I'm already right here. One, two, now I close that, that's it, this comes through, and I just go ahead and roll. Right. Where you that's, that's it, that's all we're doing. Because as this seeks this, this seek is that. Right, that's already a center lock, that's already that front kick to the nut sack, that's that outward wrist lock, that's that pitch. <laughs> this strike comes, where am I at? I'm right there, and we're back in the interior roll. Okay, so that's just one and two. I call it one because you're striking here and he feeds, he's coming off a of one line. So it's coming off the interior roll. I do singles and wally and I feed that over here, he strikes, that's coming off a of two. So I'm going to the pass as opposed to the stop. So we roll it to the exterior. As I pick that up, see I'm picking that up and just feeding that back at him. So when two's coming through, I want my perceptual speed because that puño is coming at my noggin. I want to be able to pick that away, move that, and hit him with his own stick. Now lock him. You know, now hit him. Or his punch comes. Where's my bong cell? See, where's his punch? I'm right there. Now I got the action of the double stick. So, man, that's such a bad little pit. This dude was a banger. He grew up in a very particular time and a very particular place, and he still finds a way to appreciate classical martial arts. And I think there's really something there. If you guys out there um, have experience in FMA, let me know in the comments. If you have experience in Wing Chun, let me know in the comments. If you have experience in Jeet Kune Do, let me know in the comments. But who I really want to hear from are the people who have experience in all three. Let me know what this video is actually all about. If you like this video, if you like Aperture Fight Focus, make sure to smash up the like button, make sure to hit the subscribe button. And if you wanna be among the first to get notified whenever we release another video, make sure to hit that notification bell. And until next time, thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you soon, all right? Peace.